Hello viewers and welcome to video number 4 for CC Innate Networking. We'll be dealing with troubleshoot connectivity between Switch 1, S31 and now this time French Router. Uh, we shall continue the lab. Now this is a different lab but a change. Now we have a duplex. Now console login is enabled. That with a short logging, you can verify with a short logging command. The switch will report a duplex mismatch. Duplex mismatch. Discover on the internet series slash one is now full duplex. We branch internet series slash zero. Full duplex. It doesn't match. So the message tells you that interface of the S switch one and branch had a different duplex setting. It won't connect. And it is a part of with layer one collection. It's a layer one collection issue. That is the, the most basic layer need to be fixed. In that configure, you just show now to do that. That's all right, we hit the switch one anyway. Even you follow injunction, I would still type. So you do show, as you see, we had a duplicate mismatch. It keeps saying that every. So we go, each next one. Now you hit enter. And uh, we're waiting to see a half duplex. Uh, if I can, yeah, that have duplex. The media type is 10 slash 100 base TX. Now, TX is a cable media. It uses a category fire cable. Um, I can tell you some bit, some amount, is a cable is suitable for a maximum distance of 100 meter. It pretty much a lens. Quite obvious for the core router. For the core, the top level, core router, we need a better distance. We need a much better cable, a much better distance. We need like cable six or seven, category six or seven, to handle this job. So most normally they do by the frequency. You do by the radio wave. Out in the open. Well, for now, what we're dealing with is we have a layer one issue. And of course, we're going to show the interface brief. Make sure. Oh, mismatch it. It is still function. It is still function, but we're going to show this off. Right, uh, I show you the little trick here. I show IP. Interface and we include uh, yeah, uh, uh, we put e slash say one. <laughs> so I know, okay. Uh, yeah, uh, if you check here, uh, I want to make sure it is up, it is up. So that means there is there is a layer two. We do have a layer two connectivity. We can connect, communicate, but not with but the layer one is a problem. So how do you create create the issue? It's pretty into you. Um, pretty much like last exercise, you're going to. But I tell you again, in order to get to the interface, you. Uh, you see, I go exit here. You go for pressure mode to enable board to the level 15 pressure mode level. Go enable and you enter the configuration terminal config T. And you go to interface E slash one interface interface internet zero slash one as shown here. Now what we want to do is we're going to change the duplex. The full. Uh, 
We're going to change to click to full. We're going to exit. Exit again. Now, we're going to copy one start. Okay, we have built a config. Now, we'll go, remember, it's so important we do this. We'll go IP, int we'll go do the show interface a slash c1. We now have a foo duplex, so the layer one issue has been solved. And now we can ping. Now the router can ping. Because the duplex has match. For the switch, it has to match. Because if it mismatch, because you see if the that way you see you need if it was sending and receiving at the same time. At the same time, from switch one to the PC, it can't do that. It can only do it once. And there's a part of the, and straight away, uh, you see, if pretend we have a customer and I were passing back and forth the product, but that to the middleman, but the middleman need to do the same. But the middleman can only pass at one at one time and only receive at one time. Big communication pattern. But here, router here, it's the same thing. Like passing and far passing and receiving. So sure I can do that to the router, but not to the PC because to the PC it's only half duplex. You can only send once. And by the way, you need to reply back. And receive. You want to be are you sending or receiving at one time? But to the router you can do both at the same time. And if the if it was we sending and receiving at the same time to the router, there's a problem. This is where we need to fix. So um, that's all I have to say. I hope you enjoyed this video. Not with, don't like this lab. I want to have a lab base, but I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you are finished, please sure you hit the end section. And if you are in the lab, exit. And don't ever, ever close the tab. Don't. Close the tab. Never ever close tab like that. If you're in the middle of a lab, don't close it because the Cisco cannot recognize it can't recognize your your finish with the lab. It doesn't work. All you're doing is just closing the browser. No, no, no. It does not. It does not. Make you and that's the same thing for the Gmail. It doesn't lock you out. It doesn't lock you out. The time running will be, still be running, and you just wasted some total time used. Gmail, same thing. If you were to lock out the Gmail, you don't know, you don't access, you don't click that, and you do not click, you don't X the tab. You must sign out properly. That way, the Gmail. Can recognize you are leaving the Gmail, you're logging out because for if you hit those X, it cannot, Gmail doesn't know you are logged out or not. Cisco here, same thing. So you do that. And if you are logged out, you go, you do inside this page. It, you know, as a center, you do it inside the center because. You do it inside the center here, you keep the center open. So you can't keep the layer below. So you're logging out, you just sign you out. But if you exit the center, center, this, the center, that's the layer, uh, that's layer five. And uh, you see that this center here, it doesn't, this center. And why this center? No, you're still locked in. But if you just X the center, you just remove it. That's not locking out. You still lock in.
So, viewers, um, I hope, please wait to subscribe and comment on my video. Um, if you like my video, give it a like. And I see you in the next episode. We will continue on initial Uto setup and configuration. For now, please enjoy.